questions and I come on over. <laughs> Pretty neat. Let me tell you about this building over here to my right. It has also seen multiple uses. It opened up in 1927, built in Mesoamerican Revival style. Uh, used as a private club for a while. It's called the Casino Club Building. Changed hands, uh, kept the name. And it's, so this is what we call Restaurant Row. A lot of uh, tables out here. And quite a few that are open, I guess, because the weather keeping folks away. But you guys are out here. So uh, brave in the cold if you want to after the tour. Come get a table, have some drinks. You'll be fine. There's Hilton Palacio do Rio, the palace on the river. Now we started right across the river from the Hilton, so we're coming upon full circle, uh, but we're not done with the tour. We're going to take a left turn up here and docking right over there in front of this restaurant. It's called Casa Rio. This is a very special dinner boat. And if you want to uh, do a dinner boat, that's always a lot of fun. It's not just Casa Rio, any of the restaurants can do them. That's why we dug out this section for the World's Fair. Uh, so we had to build a hotel is now in Guinness World Return and go over to the mall as promised. And uh, here is our final loading dock right up ahead. And speaking of heads, well, I'm still the tallest boat captain out here at six foot five ahead of time. We also have a Dave and Buster for the kid at all of us, right? And even though the mall is 88 at the 20 year anniversary of the World's Fair. But there's more to the mall than just this right here. This is all I can show you in the boat. Please have a seat to take your picture. Thank you. Over here on my left, on the other side of that wall, there's a new section that opened up a few years ago. That's where those attractions are, like the Legoland, the Sea Life Aquarium, and the Dave & Buster's. It's over there. So all together, the uh, mall is a little over a million square feet, second largest in the city. Like I said, a lot more than what you can see right here. As we go around this island at uh, pre-pandemic times, we have a lot of concerts and festivals here. Let me tell you, there's a owl the whole world is right back here behind me at our giant 61 in honor of him. Now several hundred years later on June 13, 1691, Spanish missionaries passed the town and even began. And in the 300 plus years since, we've had many, many, really dozens of different countries and cultures and ethnic groups all contribute to our rich cultural history. So we're, and I've seen it over the years on my boats uh, doing, doing this fun job. I've had people from all over the world on my boats, from every single U.S. state, every single continent and well over 70 countries and the list continues to grow so wherever you guys